bullfrog in Milano with a Romano. Um, Romano has decided to take us back a little bit in the barber field, and I'm just going to ask him a couple questions to find out exactly what it is that uh, that he's doing. So, Romano, pleasure to meet you. Just had a, a great experience with, uh, with one of your barbers here, and uh, he lined me up and, and also shaved my head. It felt good. Tell me, what what in in today's society? Because we're we're very instant, microwave, fast food, everything yeah. is quick. What made you decide to have this, where you have a moment to really take a moment for yourself, especially as a man? Okay. The first of all, I start at this barber shop because I take one year for myself, mm -hmm. and I think it was the right time in my life to take a moment okay. for me. So I had this idea about to start up a, a traditional American barber shop in Italy that is when people feel good. Mm -hmm. They're good to take a moment. And the passion for the beer starts from me because I'm from Sicily. Ah. So I have a very good knowledge in my background, but which is a barber. When I arrived in 1996 for my specialization, I didn't find any barber that is my idea. The barber is just not to have a good haircut and shave or beard. Sure. It's a situation, a place where you can stay with your friend or people like you. Mm -hmm. Like in the bar, you don't talk about political, football, and religion, exactly. but you stay with other men. Mm -hmm. We started this project on the 7th of June of last year, and we have straight focus on traditional haircut, mm -hmm. like this. Mm -hmm. Haircut that exists more than 100 years. We begin to work a lot on the beer. Okay. The beer on the shave. Shave uh, with a traditional process of uh, American culture. Mm -hmm. We do a long shave about 45 minutes. Mm -hmm. Set seven up towel, two shave, and uh, cold towel at the end. So it's Chicago style. Right. That never see in Italy. So people say, wow, what is it? It's the mm -hmm. first time. So people say, ah, oh, it's about a lot of money for it. Mm -hmm. I can give you a prorazo mm -hmm. and play with the toilet. We're going to the same shape. <laughs> with right, 50 right. cents, we are okay. Yeah, no? Exactly. So, if you want to take one hour for you, this is the place. Mm -hmm. And begin to work. You are the new say, I very soon to start up a barber shop in 2013 during the crisis. Say, no. Because in uh, 1929, during the big crisis, mm -hmm. one of the only businesses that never had a crisis was the barber shop. Exactly. Because people need a good look, but they need cheap fields. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Cheap because there is no big economical impact, but mm -hmm. very good field sensation when they are told mm -hmm. right. So I believe in this and this works. Wow. Not only is it traditionally American, but it is traditionally Italian because a lot of the barbers in the States early on were, were Italian barbers, especially in the in the Five Points uh, Absolutely. In, in New York and, and also in Chicago. But in fact, it was strange because all the time that I was aboard, and we talk about barbers, people say about Italy or Sicily, mm -hmm. and when we talk about Prorazzo, ah, great products. And in Italy, you don't find no more people that use the blade, the straight razor. Right. There is no more barber, and Prorazzo, you find the supermarket like a cheap product. Mm -hmm. So the idea is that no Italian barber shop, American barber shop, but with a mix of culture, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. We start up the, this place in June with two barbers. One resident barber is an Italian guy, third generation of barbery. And one Canadian guy from, uh, is a very good friend of mine. He's come here for the startup for three months. Mm -hmm. He's all right with the traditional American style of, of barbering. Mm -hmm. It was two all together in the same room, 23 right. square meters. Right. So wow. it was fun. After one week, uh, the different style began to mix together. Because the traditional uh, clip uh, fade mm -hmm. American style begin to merge with the common scissor of Italian style. Right. They move the chair. Normally, the, the Italian style of barbering or haircut is a, a client is in front of the mirror, like, like in television. No? Mm -hmm. Never move the chair. Take a look now. Didn't and the know? barber and the hair the and the barber moves around. around you know? ah. So. American style, you move the chair, you work on it online because you have a different clipper, mm -hmm. a lot of cable, you can move around the client. Exactly.